Joy the Jellyfish in Mind Your Business, Ozzy. Joy the Jellyfish fled through the water. The tiny blue-ringed octopus, one of the most dangerous creatures in the ocean, closed in. Joy raced ahead. She, she was in no danger at all. They were simply playing hide and seek. The jellyfish searched for a hiding place, so headed to the kelp beds. Buckingham, the blue-ringed octopus, watched her disappear into the seaweed. He did not like the seaweed, which tangled his tiny tentacles. Don't be afraid, Joy yelled. You are one of the bravest creatures around. Come find me. I will count to ten. Buckingham surged ahead, but Joy was nowhere to be seen. Five, four, three, two. But before she reached number one, Joy popped out of the kelp. You never said one. I guess you won. I didn't find you in time. I never said one because you are the one. And I won the day I met you. Buckingham giggled. I know a great hiding place if you want to follow me this time. They arrived at an old shipwreck. Oh no, Ozzy's here, Buckingham grumbled. You two shouldn't be here, Ozzy said. The rusty old wreck may collapse at any moment. Ozzy proceeded to ramble on about the possible dangers of the possible ground tremors and how they might possibly affect the possible collapse of the rusted wreck. Joy listened politely, but Buckingham had had enough. He rudely told Ozzy to mind his own business. Joy was highly embarrassed, but guiltily followed Buckingham as he raced off to play. He always gets his nose in everyone's business, Buckingham complained. Don't pay any attention to him. I've been inside this wreck a dozen times, and nothing has happened. Joy was not so sure. Buckingham slithered through a porthole. But the jellyfish stopped short. Come on, Buckingham urged. What are you waiting for? Suddenly, the old ship began to shake. Bubbles burst. The ground buckled. The ship began to break apart. Buckingham raced out of an opening in the bow. A loud thunder shook the ocean floor. What about Ozzy? Joy wondered worriedly. Back at the Great Barrier Reef, Stephanie Seahorse heard a loud crash. She raced to the scene. What happened? she cried. Where's Ozzy? Joy asked. Ooh, the old octopus said. That was a close call. I, I am really sorry I told you to mind your own business, Ozzy. When you care about others, their safety is always your business, Ozzy replied tenderly. And on that day, some of the smallest creatures in the ocean realized that someone was looking out for them. And that someone, old and wiser, would always be there for them. <laughs>